you open your mouth. and give God a praise. Come on, open your mouth and magnify. Come on and lift Jesus high. Somebody give God a good praise. He's worthy to be praised. Somebody, somebody magnify the King of Kings. Somebody lift up the Lord of Lords. His name is Jesus. Somebody praise him. Reach the person next to you and say, neighbor, my good neighbor, I'm glad to see you tonight. You're at the right place, at the right time, for your miracle. You're at the right place, at the right time, for your breakthrough. Clap your hands and praise. And the precious name of Jesus Christ. Somebody praise him one more time. Come on, one more praise in this house. One more praise in this house. Jesus is worthy. Jesus is worthy to be praised. He's Lord, he's master, he's God. He is the strong tower. Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Somebody give him a wave offering tonight. While you remain standing, turn your Bibles with me to Genesis chapter 11. Glory to God. Genesis chapter 11. Let me give glory, honor, and praise to the Lord Jesus Christ, who is the head of my life. The holy angels that are here tonight, they are here to do warfare on behalf of the people of God. We thank God for the holy angels. Somebody give God a praise. Hallelujah, uh, hallelujah to God. God is a good God. God is a good God. And there is none like him. I want you to understand tonight that God is on the move. He's unstoppable. He's great and he's awesome. He's God alone. And we just got to praise him. Hallelujah, Hallelujah to God. Greet the clergy. Greet all saints of the most high God. Visiting friends, I greet you. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Men quiet. Standing up for Jesus. God is a good God. Uh, hallelujah. Today we had a Holy Ghost blast. 
You can hear it in my voice, huh? It was a Holy Ghost blast in Kingston. Nine persons were baptized in the name of Jesus Christ. And one was filled with the power of the Holy Ghost, with the evidence of speaking in tongues. Somebody give God a praise in him. Somebody shout a glory. Turn to the person next to you and say, the devil is mad. But be steadfast. Come on, tell two people, the devil is mad. But hold fast to the name of Jesus Christ. Where are the worshippers? Are you here? Come on, are you here? Are you here? Glory to God. Genesis 11 verse 1. When you are there, just shout word. And the whole, world, the whole earth was of one language and one speech. And it came to pass as they journeyed from the east. East of God and east of Eden. From the east. That they found a plain in the land of Shinar. And they dwelt there. We're at verse 3 now. Let's go in a little bit. And they said one to another. Go to. Let us make bricks. And burn them thoroughly. And they had bricks for stone. And they have slime for mortar. Brick for stone. And slime for mortar. Don't miss this brick for stone and substitute brick for stone and slime instead of mortar. Verse 4, are you there? Then they say, Go to, let us build us a city and a tower whose top will reach unto heaven and let us make us a name lest we be scattered abroad upon the face of the whole earth and the Lord came down and see one the city and see two the tower which the children of man Bill, the children of men Bill, and the Lord said behold the people they are in one accord they are sinners but they are in one accord and they are and they have all one language and this they begin to do and now nothing will be restrained from them which they have imagined to do. Go to, let us go down. And there confound their language. That they may not understand one another, one another speech. So the Lord scatter them abroad. Thence upon the face of all the earth. And they left off they still have the plan to build this city. Read the rest when you go home. Let's read verse 1 and 2 of chapter 12. Are you at verse 1 and, and 2 of chapter 12? Huh? Now the Lord said after the system that opposed the will of God when they are finished and God move and scatter who to, to be scattered. And confound who is to be confounded. Then, now the Lord had said unto Abraham, Get thee out of thy country, and from thy kindred, and from thy father's house, and to a land that I will show thee. Come on, let's talk now. And I will make thee a great nation. They are looking for a city, but God is giving a nation. 
and I will bless thee and make thy name great. They want to make their own name, but God said, I will make your name great, and thou shalt be blessed. I and I will bless them that bless thee and curse them that curse thee and in thee shall all the families of the earth be blessed let us talk to our father eternal God our creator God that declared that there be light and there was light we thank you tonight we are here one more time please do a quick work let your divine will be done. Let your angels of free course speak to your church. Do it again, Lord. Somebody clap your hands and tell the Lord Jesus, thank you. Come on, tell the Lord Jesus, thank you. Thank you, Lord. Somebody say, not my will, but thy will be done, Jesus. Somebody give him a praise. You may be seated. You may be seated in the presence of the most high God. Hallelujah. We know in Genesis, God creates Adam, and inside Adam was Eve. And the Bible said God took a rib and make a woman and the woman the woman the woman became the mother of the living god intended he said to adam and eve i want you to understand that i am in charge he said to adam and eve i'm giving you the keys of the kingdom he said to Adam and to Eve, Adam and Eve, I want you to understand that there are enemies all around. Enemies on the outside. But be strong now, Adam and Eve, because I'm giving you the power to trample everything. And God said, hallelujah, let them, he said, he make them after his image and after his likeness and God and God said let them have dominion over the fish and when you go to verse 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 and, and let them have dominion over the fish of the sea over the fowl of the air and over the cattle and over all the earth and over all creeping things that creep it on the earth. So God made man in his own image. In the image of God create he him. Male and female create he them. And God bless them. And God said unto them, Be fruitful, be productive, and multiply. Replenish the earth subdue it have dominion over everything that's God's will for man glory to God God intended for Adam and Eve to fill the earth with sons of God yes God uh, said let them have dominion let them subdue and let them replenish. Let them be the king. Let them have authority over and let them produce more of their kind. Adam never produced another Adam. Adam produced a man that carries a dead spirit. God's intention was Adam to pro produce sons of God, those that are alive in the spirit. But God said, the day you touch, eat of that fruit, you shall die. And because he died, his race born living dead. Alive in the physical, but dead in the spirit. 
And that's the reason why the last Adam came. The first Adam was a living soul. But the last Adam is a quickening spirit. Quickening spirit. Life giving spirit. And he said you must be born again. Because except you are born again. You cannot inherit. The kingdom of God. Flesh and blood. Cannot. Inherit. The kingdom of God. You have got to be born of the water. And of the spirit. We see now that it is God's divine will to fill the earth of, with spirit-filled beings. Beings that are able to tap in the realm of the spirit. Connect to the kingdom of God. Because the garden of Eden was an extension of the kingdom of God. It was just a colony of the kingdom of God. And it was God's will for Adam and Eve to fill the earth, expand, widen the borders so that the whole earth will become an Eden. Eden means the presence. It means where the pleasure is. It means where God's divine glory resides. The Bible says that because of what Adam did, here came Cain and Abel. We know it. Cain killed his brother Abel because of covetousness. He killed Abel because Abel was blessed. Because the Bible said God have respect for Abel's sacrifice offering. But God have no respect to Cain's offering. Why? Because uh, Abel gave of his firstling. Abel gave God the best, but Cain gave an offering. You can't outgive a person that is giving their best. Now, I don't care if your best is a thousand and your best is just twenty. If your offering is a thousand and yours are twenty, uh -huh, God is not looking on the amount. God is looking from the heart. The amount is coming from. Oh, Shia. And Abel, Abel gave his best, but Cain did what he pleased. And because of that, the breakthrough, the blessing, everything that Abel touched turned gold. And things was hard for Cain. And Cain, that boy of the wicked one, carries a covetous spirit. He decides, I'm getting Abel out. Oh, God Almighty, and we see that Cain killed Abel. And the devil rejoiced. The reason why the devil rejoiced because, you see, the devil thought Cain was the seed of the woman. Genesis 3, 16, 15, God says, the seed of the woman shall bruise the serpent's head. Are you coming with me? When the devil heard that, he's looking for a seed. So when Cain came on the scene, he thought Cain was the seed. Are you coming with me now? And so he get into Cain and turn Cain evil. But when he look, Abel begin to live righteous. And Abel began to bless God with everything. And the devil was confused. He said, all right, it seems like it's not Cain. It must be Abel. So he get into Cain and kill Abel, believing that he's cutting off the seed. Oh, Shia. But when he killed Abel, the Bible said God gave Adam and Eve another son. His name is Seth. And the Bible said when Seth came on the scene, the Bible said men begin to call upon the name of the Lord. Is there any warrior in this house? Because the devil can't stop 
Anything God put a go on. Oh, Shia. The devil can kill anything God appoints to live. The devil can block anything God hand is on. Go ahead, devil. You can't kill the man child until he's at Calvary. You take him at that hill and try to throw him down. In. But you can't kill him, boy. Where is the worshippers? Oh, devil, if you know that Jesus came to die, you would have kept him alive. Had they known, they would not have crucified the Lord of glory. God have a way to hide his people. Shia. I said, God have a way to hide his anointing. You can't know them. You don't know them. You don't know them. God hide them. Oh, Shia. Oh, slap your neighbor and said, hide me, Holy Ghost. Hide me from that covetous spirit. Hide me, Holy Ghost. Hide me from that hate. Hide me from that wicked spirit. Hide me. Somebody jump up, slap your seat and say, hide me under the blood. Where the devil can't do me no harm. Help me out and tell him thank you. It's kind of a little bit tight. Tell him thank you. The devil can't stop you. Tell the Lord thank you. You can be hindered, but you are unstoppable. Come on, I want you to repeat it four times in this house. Turn to four people, tell them, I can be hindered. But I am unstoppable. Oh Lord, you need to release it. Release it. I can be hindered, but I cannot be stopped. For greater is he that is in me than he that is in the world. He's an attacker, you know? he's a warrior. You know? The seed of the woman is under attack. For God said, I put enmity. Someone said, God said, I put enmity between your seed and her seed. There is a line drawn, a line of demarcation. You can't come over here. Over here is covered with the blood. Oh, Shia. Shanda. Yamasaya. You better slap your neighbor, say neighbor. You can't bring the world in the church. The world is the world, and the church is the church. Mm. Come on, slap two people, tell them the world is the world, and the church is the church. And the meeting is between the two. Who am I talking to? Mm. Kind of tight. Drag your neighbor and say neighbor. My good neighbor, God said to tell you, there is a line drawn. They are over there, and we are over here. Come on, where is the wash worship in here? I said, oh, they walk over here, and the church over here. The sorcerer is over there, and the Holy Ghost filled, fire baptized, sanctified, child of God is over here which side are you on up me a mouth take two minutes and shout a strong praise i said take two minutes and let hell know let hell know let hell know that you are on the lord's side come on which side are you on Take your right hand, put it in the hand of your neighbor. Shake that hand a little bit. Open your mouth wide and say, neighbor, my good neighbor, love not the world, neither the things that are in the world. If any man love the world, the love of the Father is not in him. It's kind of flat. Let go that hand. Hold on to somebody else. Shake the hand like you want to shake it off. And say, neighbor, for all that is in the world is the loss of the flesh, the loss of the eyes, and the pride of life. 
hand is not of the Father. Come on. But is of the world. Who am I preaching to? Who am I preaching to? Find somebody else and say, neighbor, my good neighbor, the world pass it away and the lust thereof. But they that do it, the will of God abide it forever. Lift up your right foot, put it down and declare it. I am a member of the body of Christ. Drag your neighbor now and say, neighbor, if you're on the Lord's side, God said to tell you, come out from among them and be separate. Touch not the unclean things and I will receive you. Say, God Almighty, open your mouth, shout a praise. Which side are you on? Up me a mouth and praise him in here. Up me a mouth and praise him in here. Up me a mouth and praise him in here. Behold, what manner of love the Father has bestowed on us that we should be called the children of God. Therefore, the world knoweth or not. Come on, tell somebody the world don't know you. The world don't like you. The world is against you. The world know us not because the world knew him not. He was in the world and the world was made by him and the world knew him not. The world don't know him. The world don't know you. Open your mouth and shout one more prayer. I want you to find two people. Use your right hand over your head and give them high five. Give them high five. And the Christian soldier, the Christian soldier, marvel not, my brethren, if the world hates you because the world hate him first who am i talking to the world not gonna love you the world not gonna like you the world not gonna hate you so make sure you come out from among them who am i talking to throw your head back open your mouth push back every attack open your mouth and praise god open your mouth and lift jesus high up me a mouth and give him one more praise. Up me a mouth and shout a glory. Shout a glory, hallelujah. Open your mouth. Shout again. I say, open your mouth. Shout one more praise. Open your mouth and lift Jesus high. I'm going in. Hold on to your neighbor. And said, neighbor, my beloved neighbor, believe not every spirit, but try the spirit, whether the spirit is of God. Because many false prophets are gone out in the world. The world is full of false prophets. True prophets are in the church of the living God. Come on, somebody. Try the spirit. 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 Hereby, hereby we know the spirit of God. Every spirit that confess it that Jesus Christ is come in the flesh is of God if him call himself a prophet if she call herself a prophetess and she don't believe that there is one God if they don't believe they must baptize in the only saving name if they don't believe they need the power of the Holy Ghost drive them out of your life rebuke that spirit 
every spirit that believe it not that Jesus Christ is Jehovah come flesh drive it out drive it out how can you prophesy to me and you don't know the truth drive it out there are the warriors open your mouth and say something come on oh come on every spirit that confess it not that Jesus Christ is come in the flesh is not of God and that is the spirit of Antichrist Antichrist spirit full the church world Antichrist spirit full the church world they walk like us they talk at like us them speaking tongues like us them copy we preaching where is the worshippers where is the warriors but try the spirit as a try the spirit try the spirit and see if an antichrist spirit the first time the spirit of antichrist was released in the world genesis chapter 10 and chapter 11 there was a good talker by the name of Nimrod and Nimrod he know how to get the people on his side that's where politics starts where is the worshippers that's where it all begins he was a good dictator he talked pretty well his grammar was intact his teeth was cross and his eyes was dark him just know how to talk the Bible says he was a mighty hunter before the Lord. What was Nimrod hunting? Nimrod was a hunter, but not a hunter of bear, not a hunter of lion and tiger, not a hunter of beast, but he was a hunter of men. He was a dictator and he talked so well until him get a big crowd behind him where is the worshippers in him he was a dictator and he was a motivational speaker who am i talking to he tell you what you want to hear politician don't look at me like that i'm dead already where is the worshippers where is the warriors in here so this is what Nimrod does. Nimrod was a good talker. And Nimrod said, I will motivate you. You know, like the third son of David. You know his name? Absa. And Absa carried the spirit of Nimrod. Absa, stand up at the gate. And, uh, and Absa, Absalom, Absa, watch the people coming in to the king. And he started throwing some words. Like, what's your problem? What are you going through? And he allowed the people to tell him. And him just starts saying, and that's how I got you. So two persons fight over one piece of land. Yes. One get the land, yes. and the other one come to me complain. Yes. And Absa meet him at the gate, and starts saying, oh God, you really mean you lose your land? What a wicked man take away your land from you. And my father is kind of busy. My father have a lot on his head, but if if my father has put somebody in charge, yes. he will that can fix that situation. Yes. And Abza said, "Don't worry, I'm gonna see what I can do." Yes, and he encouraged you. You're gone. The man will take a land from you. Come yes. and come at the gate, and Absa meet him. And said, what's happening with you now? 
And this man said, you know, said, me, 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 a piece of land, one man next door to me, me not like how he behave. And me end up of a defeat him and take away the land. Absan, I look on you and tell you, say, that's wrong, give back the money land. Absa want everybody to feed him side. So Absa said, oh, I didn't know that's how the story go. I understand your side, man. And, and when Absa done, Absa win fear heart. And fear heart. All right. Let, let, let's go over here. You are in power. And watch the politicians now. Why? Them over there, sir. They might do good in a boat. Look on the road. You ever see no water in that community? If you ever just give me a chance. He, he's ruling, but. He's not for the people. They, 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 they can't feel what poor people feel. In. If I just get a chance, I will make sure you get water and your road fixed and all who don't have house get house and all who have no job, I put things in place. I'm going to make sure I raise up the Thank you, son. So when I come in power, minimum raise must go up. Nimrod was a good talker. And Nimrod said to the people, come, let us build a city. Let us build a tower. The reason for the tower, anywhere we go, we must stay connected. Anything you are doing, I must see you and hear you. Let us stay connected. Come on. Oh, shy. And let us make a name for our. In other words, the spirit that was released is a spirit that say, I don't need God to do nothing for me if I work hard enough. Jesus, I want to pull somebody with me and touch a neighbor and say, let we have some church and let's expose an unclean spirit. Where are the worshipers? Are you here with me? Come on, listen now. I read it and you don't understand it, so let me exegete it, please. It came to pass as they journeyed to the east, from the east, they found a plain in the land called Shai Shinar. That's in Mesopotamia, it's which present day Iraq yeah. and, Ma and first time Babylon. Yeah. You're coming with me, Shia. And they said one to another, Let us make bricks for stone and slime for mortar. Can I exegete that, please? You see. Brick is man made, while stone is God made. Slime is man made, while mortar is God made. So, what they plan that day is to substitute God with human effort. Where is the warriors? Are you here with me, please? Come on, so the spirit of Antichrist is. I don't need God to do anything. I can achieve it on my own. You better be careful of the world. Because the world and their motivational speakers, all they do is pump you. All they do is tell you not to eat from the tree of life. But eat from the tree of the knowledge of good and in other words you don't need God Lord Jesus I wonder if I can pull somebody with me 
I wonder if I can pull somebody with me. Shire, you better touch your neighbor and say, neighbor, if the Holy Ghost is not going to do it, I don't want it to be done. And if God is not watching the city, the watchman, Oh, Shire. And if God not in the house, they that wait, wait it in vain. Come on, if God not build this city, who am I talking to? They that build it, build it in vain. Because fire is coming. I said, fire is coming. This heaven shall roll back like a skull, and God shall burn up every works in vain. Yeah, Messiah. The spirit of Antichrist is the spirit that depends on self. Shia Messiah. First, the spirit is coming into the earth. The spirit manifests through Nimrod. Shia Messiah. And Nimrod said, come on now. Let us do it on our own. We don't need no God to help us. Let us build our name. Let us build our city. And let's stay connected with the tower. But thank God, when Genesis 11 was finished, Genesis 1, Genesis 12 come on the scene. And in Genesis 12, God said, all right, the world system set up. Tell your neighbor that's the beginning of the world system. Come on, the world system. Come on, but slap your neighbor. Say there's an enmity between the world and the church. Who am I talking to? I said there's a difference between the world and the church. And if God save you, stay safe. Who am I talking to? If God call you, stay call. Oh, Shia, where is the warriors? It's kind of flat, too tight. Come out, man. Walk away, man. Love that the world. You love the world too much. Stop smoke. Stop drink. You're a child of God. You hear it, Bishop. You hear it, Bishop. I don't mind. I don't mind. I say, I don't mind. You're a child of God. Child of God no go a club. Child of God no go a pool party. Child of God no wind up yourself. When it's a child of God, you walk a child of God. You talk a child of God. When God come in your spirit, you don't wear the things you used to wear. You don't go the place you used to go. You don't act the way you used to act. You don't talk. Come out. Warriors, are you here? Worshippers, are you here? Shia Messiah. I'm going in. Come on, let's walk. And so the world, the system was set up. And the spirit that is against Christ. When we say Antichrist, Shia. When we say Antichrist, it does not only mean against Christ it also means instead of Christ a replacement of Christ where is the worshippers in him where is the warriors in him where is the believers in him so the spirit of antichrist Israel was crying for a messiah to come give us Christ Lord Messiah, we need Christ to come and deliver us. They were crying for Christ. They took the Christ to the whipping post. And after they give the Christ, the lashes. Herod called for the Christ to come forth. And then Herod called for somebody else. Herod called for 
Barabbas. Who he called for? You know what the word Barabbas means? Barabbas means son. Bar. Anytime you read in the Greek, in the New Testament, and you see the word bar. It's a shortening. It's a Greek. It's the Greek for son. So one, you see Barabbas. Barnabas. Bara. Bar. It means son of. So Barabbas. Bar. Abba. 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 Father. So son of the father. Yeshua. So his name was Bar, son of Abba. And then you see us, Christ, us, Jesus. So he had the name Jesus at the back. So he's son of the father, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Can I teach you something deep? So, he was son of God, Jesus. That's his name. So, over the side, you have Barabbas, son of the father, who is Jesus. And you have over the side, the real son of the father, Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Hallelujah. Now, anybody in here know what? Barabbas was charged for? Huh? Eh? He was an insurrector. He was a what? He start riots. You're coming with me. I'm going to tell you what his charge was. He inspired the Jewish people. To come. You, you, you ever wonder why? Why it is said that Barabbas, that Jesus was crucified between two thieves? He was called a thief. Come on, man. But that word thief in the Greek is not referring to somebody come and steal something from you. The Roman government came in and take over Israel. So they say everybody in Israel belongs to Rome. So when Barabbas begin to call people, he's a good talker. Oh, Shia Messiah. He was a, 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 a what you call motivational speaker. So Barabbas he promised the people that he's going to bring deliverance to them. He's going to deliver them from the hand of the Romans. Come on, come on. Promise them deliverance. Oh, Shia. Oh, Shanda. What are you trying to say, Bishop Baker? I want you to know that on this side, one who act like a Christ, he wants to be in the place of the true Christ. He's saying that you don't need the true Christ. If you come and join yourself with me, you don't need any help from God. We can fight the battle on our own and we can defeat the enemy and get deliverance on our own while the other one is over here and say I come to give my life as a ransom for sin he come and said I am the good shepherd and the good shepherd give it his life for the sheep where are the worshippers in here the true Christ was standing there and the false Christ 
was on the other side and it blows my mind the true Christ right there and a figure of the Antichrist over here and when the true Christ stand with blood coming down his face and all over his body expecting these people to go towards him the people look at Barabbas the insurrector and say give us Barabbas and Reach your neighbor and I want to say, neighbor, don't you expect the world to choose you? Don't you expect and see to love you? Don't you expect they are going to put you at the front? They rather their own. Who am I talking to? They crucify the Christ and say, Give us Barabbas. You better reach your neighbor, say, Neighbor. Don't expect them to call you holy. Don't expect them to call you sanctified. Don't expect them to shake your hand and say you're a man of God. They're going to call you Obia man. They're going to call you false prophet because the world hate the people of God and the world love their own. Somebody throw your head back man. Up me your mouth and shout one more praise. Shout one more glory. Shout one more glory. I wonder if I can find 10 people who understand this message. I thank God that God never leave himself without a witness. The whole world was with Nimrod. The whole world was following Nimrod. The whole world came together and was building the tower. But thanks be to God. God looked down from heaven and said, come let us go down and confound via language. Mix them up. Turn them against themselves. Who am I talking to? You better slap your neighbor. Say, neighbor, you don't have to worry. When God get ready, they will fight their own. Who am I talking to? You don't have to fight for yourself. God will turn them against themselves. Where is the worshippers? It's kind of flat. I said, throw your head back. Open your mouth and tell your neighbor the battle is not yours. I said, tell your neighbor the battle belongs to God. Stand still and see the salvation of the Lord for the enemies you see today. You shall see them again no more. There were three kingdoms come up against Jehoshaphat. But Jehoshaphat come into the house of God. Jehoshaphat write daddy a letter. He brought the letter to the altar and said, God, I can't fight them. They are more than us. They're more powerful than us. They're more stronger than us. They outnumber us. But I heard somebody, the spirit of prophecy, sweep in the room. And somebody said, Jehoshaphat, God said to tell you, this battle is not yours. Stand still. Where are the worshippers? Where are the warriors? Where are the worshippers? Tomorrow, tomorrow, when you go out, put the Judites, put the worshippers, put the praisers at the front. Let them go before you. And when the praisers begin to praise God, and when the worshippers begin to worship God, God send ambushment. I said, God, let the enemy turn on themselves reach your neighbor say neighbor it's in the atmosphere now you don't have to fight you don't have to worry God say he must send ambushment let them fight them one another who am I talking to somebody throw your head back let them war them one another holy ghost holy ghost overturn overturn it overturn it holy ghost oh. 
Shia. Anybody feel the overturn? Anybody feel the overturn? Holy Ghost, overturn. Overturn it. Overturn it until the buckle is won. Overturn. Overturn until the last become the first. Overturn it. Overturn it until the last become the first and the tail become the head. Overturn. Somebody throw your head back. Prophesy over your life. God is overturning. He's overturning. He's overturning the plots, the traps, the schemes of the enemy, the co-workers turn against you. The whole management board, the whole supervisor board turn against you. But go to your bed tonight. Get a good night's sleep for while you're sleeping. Holy Ghost, I overturn, overturn. Somebody give God an overturn praise. Give God an overturn. Shia. Yamasaya. Shanda. Yabasa. Rapa papa basa. Somebody help me a mouth. Help me a mouth. Help me a mouth. Help me a mouth. Shout again. Shout again. Shout again. Help me a mouth. Lift Jesus higher. Shia. Yamasaya. Yapapapasa. Somebody give him a praise. Give God a high praise. Shout a glory. Overturn Holy Ghost. Overturn Holy Ghost. Overturn Holy Ghost. Overturn. Overturn. Until the poor become rich. Overturn. Until the weak become strong. Overturn. Overturn. Until the sick becomes healed. Somebody, throw your head back. Open your... Shout again. Shout again. Shout again. Shout again. Somebody say, confound them, Holy Ghost. Somebody say, confound them, Holy Ghost. Confound them, Holy Ghost. Confuse them, Holy Ghost. Shia. Shanda. Yamasai. I release it over this house. Whatever the enemy is planning for you. Comprehensive blood coverage. Find somebody and tell them anything. The enemy plan for you tonight. I cover you. I hide you. Where they can find you, I hide you. Somebody give him one more praise. Somebody shout one more glory. Shout a glory, hallelujah. Shout a glory, thank you, Jesus. Somebody give him one more praise. Give him one more praise. Everybody in this house, two hands in the air. The Antichrist spirit is the spirit that wants to push the Christ out of the way. It's the spirit that tells you, you don't need Christ. You can do it on your own. But thanks be to God. There was an Abraham who God released a word, Abraham. Who God released a word over him. God says, stay under my blood. Abraham, stay. Be perfect and walk. Oh, Shia. You don't need to know where you're going. Just walk when God says walk. Where is the worship? I squeeze that hand. You don't need no detail. Shia. God said, I'm give you daily bread. I'm going to supply you today. Just walk. 
walk by faith. Oh, Shia. Oh, Shanda. Yeah, Messiah. Squeeze that hand. And God said, The world said, Come, let us do it on our own. The world say, if you work hard enough, you can achieve anything you want. Where is the warriors in here? But God say, the kingdom of God is opposite to the world. God say, if you please me hard enough without faith. It is impossible to please God. He that cometh to God must first believe that God exists. And when you are sure that God is here, then God said he's a rewarder. Not to everybody, you know. He's not a rewarder to everybody in the church, you know. Please don't get it twisted. He's not a rewarder for everybody we are said Jesus. He's not a rewarder to everyone we're born of the water and of the spirit. But he make it clear who is a, he is a rewarder to. So don't miss the point. Oh, Shia. Oh, Shia. Shia. Somebody's a rewarder. That word rewarder means one who pay wages. Write down that. What the word reward I mean? One who pay wages. A wages payer. But watch this. He's a rewarder to them. That. This is not the Baptist. Up your mouth. He's a rewarder to them that diligently seek him. Carefully seek him. Looking with all their desire on their heart to find him. He's a rewarder to them that take the time to seek and feel after him. He's a rewarder to them that nobody got to tell to fast. Nobody got to tell them to seek his face. Nobody got to tell them to search for God. David said, as the heart panted after the water brook. The heart is a male deer. And the male deer in the desert. There's something in the male deer. It search for water. And anywhere the water it and the, the plant with water. The male deer find it. David said, as the male deer search for water and find it, so is my heart. Panting after God, the living God. He said, early in the morning, I wake up and I seek your face. Oh God, can I find 10 people in here who diligently seek God? Who am I talking to? Abraham! If you diligently seek the face of God, this is what I'm going to do for you. I am going to. They are building cities for themselves. But God said, Abraham, if you seek me hard enough, I'm going to give you houses you didn't build. I'm going to give you vineyards. Somebody said, businesses you didn't start. Who am I talking to? Who am I talking to? You better let them feel you. Tell the neighbor, God want to give you a breakthrough. God want to give you a healing. God want to give you some gifts. God want to impart the gift of healing inside your spirit. The gift of miracles inside your spirit. God want to hand out the gift of prophecy in your spirit. But you know, come overnight, you got to seek him with all your heart you've got to be a diligent seeker who am I talking to squeeze that hand we're going in you can't fool man but you can't fool the baby demons where is the worshippers in here I said you can't fool man 
But you can't fool principalities and powers. So if you can't fool demons, how you gonna fool God? Where is the worshiper? Squeeze that hand. Squeeze that hand. Anything you love, you go after. If a woman you want, a woman you go after. Where is the worshippers in here? Where is the warriors in here? Where is the believers in here? Where is the believers in here? I say, anything, wherever a man's heart is, there is treasure is. Wherever your treasure is, there your heart is. So if you want to find a heart, look for the treasure. And if you want to look for, the, if you want to find a treasure, look for the heart. Where is the warriors in here? Anything you love, you go after. You will never see answer for the sorrowy. Squeeze that hand, let them feel you. I say, squeeze that hand. Shy my God, my my my. Shaya, somebody's gonna cry tonight. Shandabashaya. Yamashaya. Shaya Basha. Where are the warriors? We're going in first. Where are the warriors? We're going in first. God say to Abraham, they are doing it for themselves. But I want to do it for those who love me. They are building their own homes and cities. But I want to give them a house, Canaan. I want to give them a land flowing with milk and honey. Milk is for baby and honey is for adult. I fill the place with things for everybody that loves me. Whether you're young or you're old, God say I have provision. Oh. Shayabasa. Squeeze that hand, we're going in. God said, I will build your houses. And God said, I am going to make your name great. Oh, Shia Basa. They are saying they are making a name for themselves. I have news for those who are making name for themselves. I have news for those who are working hard to make a name for yourself. There was a man. He used to run things. A Mark Marinium. You remember Bujo Bantan? You remember how Bujo Bantan named it big? Yes, sir. Huh? Yes, sir. You remember? Yes, sir. Everybody, when I said reggae and dance, I'll have Bujo. Yes, sir. And when Bujo got in a prison, Bujo did a prison for a couple of years, don't it? Come on, and testify, we testify. Yes, sir. Huh? And when we say Bujo I come, everybody has said, wow, Bujo I come back and run things again. But when Buju come on full national stadium, yes. everybody say, yes, Buju back on the scene. Yes. Huh? Yes, sir. But when they know? Yes, sir. Name gone. Yes, sir. Vibes Cartel. Yes, sir. Did a bomb up the place. Yes. When you look at Jamaica, every, almost every boy have on clocks. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And he lie. Saying you use cake soap for bleach. Cake soap can't bleach your light every way. All right, let's have church. Hey. Vibes can't tell name did. Big in a man. Where is the worshippers in? Beanie man name did. Bounty killer name did. Ninja name did. But I have news for you. When you make name for yourself, your name go up and drop both. So I don't want to make no name for myself. Where is the worshippers? 
the world make name for themselves. And in the process, them deal with some people. Then step on some people if we go up. Then kill some people if we go up. They destroy some people. If I should have gone in on that, you know, because I was touching it today in Kingston. Somebody said the world and the church is different. The world make a name for themselves. But the church depends on God to make your name great. Where is the worshipers in here? I'm going in. Give me five more. Yeah, some people were calling themselves church people. They, they call them influencers and YouTubers. And you know them? Them call them bloggers. That wants likes. Where is the worshipers in here? Where is the warriors in here? You see in the world, this is how they operate in the world. Bunticular run things. And you see while Bunticular name and run things, Bunticular have theme fans. And while Bunticular have theme fans, one, one look at you from Mantico be a name, Merciless. Come on, come on. Merciless realize eh, Bounty Killer big. So Merciless just start uh, call Bounty Killer name. You know hear me? Just start uh, call Bounty Killer name and go on like he wants to clash with Bounty Killer. So when he do that now, Bounty Killer fans, one who are this Merciless, I uh, call up my boss name. So then gone over. Merciless side gone see what go on. But a trick, a trick, a worldly wisdom, merciless I use. Merciless wants on fame. So merciless now start, go at a man with the fame. Oh God, where is the real Christians in here, man? Where is the real Christians in here? But I come to tell somebody that the church is different from the world. Those who are in the kingdom of God not try and make a name for themselves. God established Abraham. And all when Abraham dead and gone, the name is still alive. Where is the warriors in here, man? It's kind of flat. Where is the worshippers in here? When God make your name great, nobody can tear it down. They'll try it up. Because you have some, you have some integrity killer. Where is the warrior? Try, try, they try. You have some, 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 some integrity assassinator. Some character killer. Where is the worshippers in here? But reach your neighbor, say neighbor. I don't have to defend myself. My defender name is Jesus. And if you ever try to touch a true child of God, you're touching yourself. So hear me now. Evangelist Blackham. That's why Bishop Baker. Now go up on Facebook. Go read comments. And go look how much likes. Where is the worshippers in here? Where is the warriors in here? Somebody, when we were coming down, Elder Evangelist Blackham said to me, We have on TikTok 50,000 followers. How much? And how much person we are follow? Huh? Me not follow nobody. And Jesus me and follow. Where is the worshippers in here? Don't look at me like that. You are in church. You're not hearing me. Come here, preacher. Come stand up here. Stand up here, sir. Come here, preacher. God put Adam in a garden and make him the head. And when God said, follow me, I am your boss, follow me. The devil got troubled the woman. And when the devil, devil troubled the woman, God said, what is this thing you have done? Guess what Adam do?
him turn to the woman and say, Lord, is the woman me a father? When God reached to the woman, God said, What is the thing? What this thing you have done? See, woman, I know. Lord is the devil. And the devil said, Yeah, man. And when you look, the devil has moved. The woman has followed the devil. And the man has followed the woman. And God turned to the man and said, Me now follow none of you. Where is the warriors in here? It's kind of flood too tight. Where is the worshippers in here? You're coming with me now. So, the world, the Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, the YouTubers want fans. The more followers and the more watch time and more money. So, yeah, and the more subscribe, more persons subscribe, is the more you can get money. So you have some so-called children of God that is on that. Them no longer work. At that, I feed them work. So them are work hard. Forget subscribers. Them I work hard. Forget viewers and likes. So in the process, they will assassinate anybody to get likes and subscribers. But I have news for that antichrist spirit. Hold on, let's talk. We're going back in. Let's talk. You. The Bible talk about the six things God hates. Yes, sir. One of the things that God hates yes, are you with shed innocent blood. Nobody believes that you only shed blood when you take knife and kill people. When you destroy people's character and reputation, God will not hold you guiltless. You want to hear a warning? A data warning? Where is the warriors in here? Now, in the world, when an assassinator, a killer, when in the physical, a gunman, a murderer, a rapist, a hitman, if they are killing, hitman, come over here, sir. Pop, 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 kill this person. Feel big. Nobody no see her. You go over there say, pop, pop, pop. Kill that person. Yes, sir. Nothing happened. Yes. You feel like you're dapper. He don't have an ear to hear. Yes, hear what God say. God say, you go on. You kill your own. You shoot your own. Well, on in a row, you know, fighting no one another, killing no one another. But the day you look at a child of God, one of God's elect, and decide you're going to kill one of God's elect, God said, He shall shorten your days for the election. You can't kill a thousand of your kind and get by. But the moment, <laughs> should I go in on that now? Let's go back here. Let's go back here now. Let's go back here. Let's go back here. Because you don't only kill physically. You can kill character and integrity. When you get up and you slander one other man, you're in a world, you're going like a Christian, and you speak all in the tongues, but you're not in a, you're not in a church. Because if you really are serve God, you're not fight people. Where is the worshipers? For though we walk in the flesh, we do not war according to the flesh. For the weapons 
of our warfare are not physical but they are mighty true God I'm going in is there anybody coming in with me watch me now you can search look for all the poco woman or man look for all the false prophets you can you find them and you say anything about them and everything all right. You could have called them all the names you want to call them. Everything is fine. But write down this today. God said the minute you touch the Lord's anointing or do his prophets no harm. You watch out. Warriors, where are you? It's kind of flat to tight. You know, I don't do these things. Huh? I don't do these things. Evangelist Blackham. Preacher, you realize when I was in the car, all of a sudden you say, me getting a spirit and leg of You see, you know what was taking place? I got a visitation around the steering. The Lord says, son, when you go there, you pull down every lying spirit. And God said, say this in the camera, let them hear. You say, Bishop Winston Baker, from a barn, me, never bow. Look in my eyes. Look in my eyes. From me, baptizing in Jesus' name, and filled with the Holy Ghost, I never bow to no other spirit but Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Look in my eyes. If God tell anybody, say me. What they call it? Say me, Winston, George Baker. If I do any ritual at all, God a liar. Look at me, devil. You don't know me. Yeah, you what I say? Me say God can't tell nobody so. And God, God tell me if you come talk it. A uncle in a familiar spirit I talk to you. I never will never can never bow to no other spirit than Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Where is the warriors in here, man? Where is the worshippers in here? From I born, from me a sinner until to the day. From I born, I never do no ritual. I never kill goat. Preacher, take your time, sir. Not even white candle me burn. That's who Bishop Baker is. Not even white candle me burn, because from me understand what is candle. Me not even want the white one in my house. Where is the worshippers in here? I use no other oil but olive oil. Where is the worship as your name, man? You better open your mouth and drive that demon out of here. Drive that demon out of here. Drive him out of here. Somebody plead the blood. So, any spirit attack to you, it means you need to come back at altar and repent. Because the only thing anybody can talk about Bishop Baker, I said me did fall in a fornication. Nothing else. Where is the worshippers in here? You don't hear what me say? Me say only thing anybody can ever at any time say me ever do is fall in fornication. And you jack up too. So leave me alone. Where is the worshippers? I, I say, I say you mess up too. Oh, Shia, I fell down, but I didn't stay down. I get up, brush myself off, and I'm living for the Lord Jesus Christ. You better drag your neighbor, no one's a neighbor. The reason why I'm so blessed is because I diligently seek him. When you are in your bed sleeping, I'm praying.
rain all night. Who am I talking to? When you're eating chicken and drinking milk, I am on fasting. Who am I talking to? You better throw your head back and say I'm blessed because I'm a diligent seeker. Somebody better throw your head back. Open your mouth. Slap that antichrist spirit. I say slap the antichrist and drive him out of here. I say slap that familiar spirit and drive him out of here. Rub me your mouth and plead the blood. I say up me your mouth and plead the blood. Up me your mouth and plead the blood. Up me your mouth and shabbat the king. Up me your mouth and yada. Somebody lift Jesus higher. Put the devil under pressure. Somebody give him one more praise. Give him one more praise. Give him one more praise. Push by the enemy. Push by the enemy. I don't need to build no new. Reach the three people and said, I don't need to make no name for myself. I don't need to defend myself. I'm not coming into no battle with you. Go find your own. Go back with your own false prophets then. Go back with your own. Leave fish. Leave real preacher alone. Go back with your demons. Who am I talking to? Go find your pastor. You hear me what God tell me? God say, tell the person there. Go back, go find your pastor. Go kneel on your pastor and beg him to forgive you. And the, and the familiar spirit where you use you will leave you. Where is the worshippers in here? Where is the warriors in here? Where is the believers in here? You don't believe me? I don't know them. I first me see them. I don't know them. I me never. Somebody bring it the video. Come show me. I me never go. Go say me I go on Facebook or YouTube. Go find out who me. You're not important. Find you say that you're the the devil side. So me not go look up you. Where is the? Where is the worshippers? Watch me now. But when I pray. I pray God mercy on them. And you know what God said? No. The two of them is the same thing. God said, go in the camera and tell the two of them to go find them pastor. And repent. Hallelujah. I don't have to send on your pastor with the rest. Where is the worshipers in here? Where is the warriors in here? And name y'all look. Where is the warriors in here? Popularity y'all look. A fame y'all look. But real Christian don't look fame. Real Christian don't look popularity. Real Christian don't look likes. Real Christian see God Almighty. Who am I talking to? And God will make your name great. Hands up. Shire, hands high. I say hands high. We put boxer to rest yesterday. You don't hear me? I said we put boxer to rest yesterday. And elder Mullins were coming from church to go down to Dialys and on my way you're the devil now right a big bridge yes. you're the devil now to me you're the devil to me now you preach too long Blood and, fire. and you're way too late yes. so may I go rain out the place yes. as the devil said that when me look, rain start come down. As in don't talk he, he start pour down some rain. Yes, Holy Ghost, lift up your hand and tell the rain, say, go on back. I lift up my hand and say, rain, you're not insult me, go ahead. I command you, back up! Shire. Where is the worshippers in here? I say, rain! Back up! I have God business to go and do. Where is the worshippers? Me just finish to God work. Me not put no time on God work. Me not, me, not, me not try cutting and chopping. Me just preach that God give me and leave it alone. I know you want to tell me say you're going to rain it out. You don't hear me? So rain. Stop! When I reach down there, God said to me, say, son, all of that is in your hand. I hear me now. No? I got to shame the demons. Hear me now? All of them are around me. Me just turn to them and say, so, as it don't so rain I come down. Hear me to them now. Hear me to them now. Look. 
Yes, when the last bucket of cement, sure, run. You know, hear me say now? You know, hear me say now? You know, hear me say? Me say to everybody around me, as the last bucket drop, yes, when Ella Mullins done, you say, run. Yes, when I say, the demon say, all right. Rain stop. Come on. Yes, you want to see? Yes, Everybody around. You wasn't there. You wasn't there. I give you a piece more. You ready? I go in the car. I sit down in the car. And the Lord talked talk to me and said, Son, show the old drug and say, I power over him. Tell him when we stop. You know what I'm saying? There is a real Christian. You don't know you. You don't know who you are. Me say me go in the car, and then in the car and I laugh. And me I say to them in the car, I say, "Hey, you didn't hear me say over there? I say by the time he put the oh shire, by the time he put the last bucket and Ella Mullin tag run, and everybody start run because rain a poor. So me sit down in the car, me I laugh with them, and then here we go say, show the devil that principality. So you have power over him. Let's kiss me teeth and say, Ren, stop! In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. My God, guess what? Guess what? Guess what? You better throw your head back if you know who you are. You better throw your head back if you know who you are. You don't know who you are. You really know who you are. Throw your head back and say, I'm a child of God. I am a royal priesthood. I am a holy nation. I am peculiar people. I am what God says I am. I can do what God says I can do. I can go where God says I can go because I am what God says I am. You don't read it in the Bible. These things that I do shall you do and greater works than these shall you do because I go to the Father and when I go up I will let captivity captive and I'll give gifts to men I make some apostles some prophets some evangelists some pastors and some teachers for the edifying of the church for the sonship to come to the right level somebody throw your head back open your mouth Hands high. Hands in the air. Feel the glory of God in this house. Feel the anointing. Feel the presence of the Most High. It's in this house. Somebody tell the Lord thank you. Somebody lift Jesus higher. Bring me a water. Bring me a water. Bring me a water. We want to worship I say something. We want to believe I say something. Somebody give God a high praise in here. Somebody shout a glory, hallelujah. Somebody shout a glory, 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 glory. A glory, hallelujah. Now listen to me now. When I'm going down in, this, in the aisles, I don't want no crowd to follow me. We are the warriors. One or two persons enough. Somebody give God a high praise in here. I reach at the door. I reach in the car, park, and as soon as I park, as soon as I park, somebody, she says she's from the United States. God sent her from the United States to come and deliver a message. And she told me everything she said was on point. Everything she said was confirmation. I wonder if she's still here or she's gone. She told me, don't worry. God is sending help. He said, God said to tell her, don't worry. I'm sending you genuine people to stand behind you and pray. She said, God says 
you are asking for order. You are asking for structure and order. Shayabasa. She wasn't there when my tears was on my pillow. Asking God for real people around me. Asking God for genuine people. I mean, those who are not looking and expecting Bishop to buy car and house and all of that. I'm not here for that. I'm here to take you to a new dimension that the glory of God is seen in you and that God become your God that bless you. Oh, Shia. Not the bishop who bless you. I'm just, I can't do it. We've had the worshipers, it's kind of tight, a little bit too flat. I finish preaching today. And one deacon went for some more and came up in the office and said, Bishop, God gave me a dream and it was seven officers, male officers he brought. He didn't even know it was seven. Seven and I am eight. Where is the worshipers in here? Where are the warriors in here? Missionary Campbell, where are you? Run, come here. Somebody said, God is doing a new thing. Come here. You know the date you brought that envelope to me? It was the 8th of December. The 8th of December, you brought eight thousand dollars when you have time you're going all the groups and you're gonna see that oh, let's stay let, let's stay come here missionary let me show you something more so on the 8th of December you brought a pastoral gift, my first pastoral gift for this year. And it have eight thousand dollars. Can I tell you something? This church was dedicated 2012, the eighth of December. Where are the worshipers in here? Where are the warriors in here? God is doing a new thing. And it's either you line up with what God is doing or God is going to walk away and left you. Where is the worshipers in here? The world is not going to run this church. The church is run by the spirit of God. You don't hear what I say. I don't care who you are. God must come first. Where are the real Christians in here? Somebody said, put God first. I don't care. Who want to turn against me? As long as God is on my side. Me with God is more than the whole world against me. Should I repeat that? Oh, Shia, tell yourself that. Tell yourself. Me with God is more than the whole world against me. Shia Basaya. So, I said that to say to you. Yes, your bishop. I got him, I say. Where is the worshipers in here? I'm not going to give you an advice that will destroy your soul. When you come to me, I'm going to give you a godly advice. When I give you the godly advice, if you hear me, I'm not change. You don't hear me. I said, if you hear me because of the godly advice, I will not bow. 
Where are the real Christians in here? Where are the real Christians in here? Well, God tell me this. God says, son, you tell the church that the theme for this year no retreat no surrender keep on digging I stop by to tell the hell me now I'm back down somebody said no I'm back in down Bishop Baker now I'm back down me now I retreat me now I surrender forward still this Jehovah's will Though the pillows dash and spray with a concrete tread, up me a mouth and shout again. Up me a mouth and shout again. You see, if my children don't love me, huh? if my children don't love me, they are come in line with me. Because me not back down. We are the worshippers in here. You want to hear Bishop Baker mutter? Tell it loud and clear. Bishop Baker say, A God me say. If you do with me there, you know, say, God me, you can't grieve. Where is the real Christians in here, man? Where is the real Christians in here? Shut your neighbor, say, If you're on the Lord's side, get up and fight. Where is the warriors in here? Open your mouth, get up and fight. Push back hell. Which side are you on? Which side are you on? Which side are you on? Up your mouth and plead the blood. I said, plead the blood. I said, plead the blood. No matter, don't plead the blood. No turning off, plead the blood. No retreat, plead the blood. No retreat. No surrender. Keep on digging. Keep on praying. Keep on fasting. Keep on worshiping. Keep on reading the word. When you're a man of God, you're going to be tested and tried. Where is the worshippers in here? I say you're going to be tested and tried. And sometimes God will allow the devil to test you with who you love. To see if you're going to back down. But reach your neighbor and say, I have a leader. He is not a jellyback leader. I have a leader. He is not a leader without a spine. He's a leader with a backbone. I got call him. I got to hire him. And anybody in my lead must come with him. Who am I talking to? You better open your mouth and plead the blood. Shout one more praise. Shout one more glory. Shout a glory. Hallelujah. Hands high. My. My God. You see that? You see that? You see that? I see you crying. And I see you crying. Come here. I see you crying. Shaya Basa. Shanya. Yamasa. Where is the worshippers in here? Where is the warriors in here? Where is the believers in here? Up your mouth and shout one more praise. Shout one more glory. Somebody shout a glory, hallelujah. Shout a glory, thank you, Jesus. Shout again. Shout again. Where is the worshippers in here? Where is the warriors in here? Somebody say something, man. It's kind of too tight. Little, oh, shy. A little bit too flat. Where is the worshippers? Where is the warriors? Somebody up, come here, son.
Elijah sent Elisha on a journey. You ready for a journey? You ready for a journey? It's that little brown girl there, Sean Grandier. Holy Ghost sent him here. Where are the worshippers? Say something. Where are the warriors? Say something, man. Where are the believers? Say something. Shia. Shia Basa. Look in my eyes. You are chosen by the Lord. You are chosen by the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Where are the warriors in here? Where are the believers in here? Where are the believers in here? Somebody say something. The devil wants to kill you. The devil wants you dead. Shaya. Ahaya Basaya. Shaya Baba Basa. Ahaya Basaya. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Shaya Basa. The pain in your body. What the doctor can take away from you. God is putting your healing in this water today. We are the Shia Basa. We are the worshippers in here. We are the believers in here. We are the believers in here. Open your mouth and shout a high praise. If what I say to you is so, and you believe God tonight, oh, Shia. If you believe God, take your right index finger, put it on the cock, and say Jesus three times. Oh, Shia. Look in my eyes. I see a military garment on you. What's that? I'm in the Navy. Shia Basa. We are the warriors in here. We are the worshippers in here. Look in my eyes now. Promotion does not come from the east, the west, the south. Promotion comes from the north. Oh, Shia. Somebody know where the north is. Come on, somebody said the north is where Jesus dwell in the third heaven. Where is the worshippers? Somebody say something. Shia. Shanda Bashaya. Stretch your hands towards this water. Shia, Father, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, we give you this water. Shia, sanctify this water. Use it to bring glory to your name. Silver and gold have I none, but such as I have, give I thee. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, drink and be healed. Not tomorrow, not next week, but right now. I mean, right now, somebody shout, Jesus, that's him. Yes, sir, that's him. That's him. Break it off. Break it off. Oh, Shia. Shia. My God, you see that? You see that? Push back. I said, push back. Push back. Every demonic attack. Push back Jesus, every demon and slaughter. Drive it. Jesus, Send it to a far country. Jesus, every witchcraft attack. Jesus, back up. Jesus, back up. Jesus, back up. Jesus, back up. Jesus, reverse. Jesus, reverse. Jesus,
We are all the worship as in here. We are all the praise as in here. We are all the belief as in here. Somebody help her, man. Help her. Somebody help her with a praise. Give God a praise. Give the Lord a praise. Open your mouth and shout at the king. Open your mouth and yell at the king. Open your mouth and celebrate him right now. Celebrate him right now. When the praises goes up, deliverance will come down. Somebody shout again. Shout again. Shout again. Shout again. Warriors, where are you? Warriors, where are you? Warriors, where are you? Warriors, where are you? My God. God. Warriors. Come here, son. Come here. Because God shall raise you. Go stand up at the door. Where is the worshippers in here? Keep the praises on. Man. Keep the praises on. Keep the praises on. Keep the praises on. I said, keep the praises. Keep the praise flowing. Keep the praise flowing. Throw your head back. I said, throw your head back away. Shout a high praise in this house. In this house. In this house. Stand up in that corner over there. Stand up in that corner over there. Somebody keep the praises. Somebody keep the praises. Somebody keep the praise. Somebody keep the praise. Shia. Yamasa. Warriors. 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 Let God arise. Warriors. I said, let God arise and his enemies be scattered. Yeah! Somebody showed war. Somebody showed war. Somebody showed war. Somebody showed war. Somebody give a war cry. It's a war cry. A war cry. A war cry. Release one more praise. Release one more praise. Release one more shout. Release one more glory. Release a glory hallelujah. Release a glory thank you Jesus. Shout again. Come here. Go stand up in the corner down there. Shia. Yeah, Messiah. Shanda. Yeah, Papa. My. My, my, my. My, 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 son. Shia. Shanda, Messiah. Yeah, Papa, Papa, son. My God, this place is charged. The glory of God is in the building. The angels of the Lord are walking up and down all over the room. Somebody open your mouth. Shout again. Shout one more praise. Shout one more glory. Shout one more glory. Shout a glory, hallelujah. I said, show the glory, hallelujah. That's it. That's it. That's it. That's it. Yeah. 
Yes! Shia! Shanda! Shia, God is doing this for you right now! Right now, right now! Somebody open your mouth and shout again! Open your mouth and shout again! Open your mouth and shout again! Shout one more praise! He's restoring your strength! I say he's restoring your strength! He's restoring your strength! Right now! Right. Somebody keep the praises on. I said keep the praises. I said keep the praises. Come hold this door. Come. Somebody keep the praises flowing. I said keep the praise flowing. I said keep the praise flowing. Up your mouth and shout again. Up your mouth and shout again. Shout one more praise. Shout one more glory. Shout a glory, hallelujah. Shout a One more praise. One more praise. One more praise. He's doing it. He's doing it. He's doing it. Right now, right now, right. That's it. Shia. He's doing it right now. Right now he's doing it. Shalabasa. Yes, I speak them out. He's in you. The Holy Ghost is in you. He's in you. Speed them out. Out of your belly shall flow. Rivers of living water. Rivers of living water. Speed them out. That's the Holy Ghost. Yes, speed them out. I said that's the Holy Ghost. Speed them out. Speed them out. Yes, sir. Somebody help her. Somebody help her. Somebody help her. Keep the praises flowing, man. Keep the praises flowing. Let it flow. Let it flow. I said, let it flow. Let it flow. Let it flow. Let it flow. Keep the praises going. Show the one more praise. Show the glory. I mean, a glory. Hallelujah. Somebody up your mouth. When the praises goes up, I said when the praises goes up, deliverance will come down. Stand up at the store. Shire. Everybody hands in the air. Hands high. There is a curfew. Nobody move. Shia Bashaya. Shia Basha. I said, there is a curfew. Nobody move. Shia Basha. There is a demonic onslaught. There's a conspiracy from hell. Our family is under attack. Touch somebody tell them your family is under attack. You don't hear what I say? Your family is under attack. And God said tonight is a night of war. Warring for your house. Warring for your children. Warring for your family members. You ready warriors? You ready warriors? You ready warriors? After three, everybody in this house, take out your sword. Your sword is in the shield too long. Take it out! Shaya. Haya basha. Yama shaya. Shaya. You know what's that? Hebrews 4 12, man. Hebrews 4, Hebrews chapter 4, verse 12. Come on, take out the sword. Everyone that is under attack, we are declaring war. We're going home to see something new. Where is the worshipers in here? Where is the warriors in here? Where is the believers in here? Somebody say something. It's not by might. It's not by power. It's by my spirit. Say the Lord of hosts. 
If there's anybody in here that is not yet baptized, just walk to this altar right now. If you need to be baptized, walk to this altar. Baptize in Jesus' name, wherever you are. Come now. We are going to do walk here. If you are not saved, come. It's your time. It's time to be baptized. In the name of Jesus Christ, warriors get ready. Warriors get ready. Warriors get ready. God is going to heal the sick. Get ready. Warriors get ready. You're not saved. Come, 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 come. You're not yet baptized in Jesus' name. Come now. Come now. Leave from where you are. Step out by faith. Come warriors, get ready. Come warriors, get ready. Take out your sword, get ready. Shaya basa, get ready. Take out your sword, get ready. Shaya basa. After three, we're going to start a war. We're going to war for the family members. We're going to war for our relatives. There's a demon going around. His name is Blood Thirst. He's looking for the souls of men. We as children of God, we're going to speak covering over our loved ones. You ready, warriors? No untimely death. We are the worshipers in here. Come on, somebody get ready now. Come on, get ready, get ready, get ready, get ready, get ready. Warriors get ready. After three, it's time for war. We're cutting down everything. We're cutting down everything. Every evil and foul spirit that was assigned against your family. We're going for them right now. Warriors, you ready? You ready? Shaya. Shanda. Yamasa. Guards you at the door. Guards you at the door. Shaya. Yamashiah. No demon now slip out. Where is the worshippers in here? I said, no unclean spirit now slip out. We're chopping up every one of them in the name of Jesus Christ. The warning angels are here. Somebody open your mouth after three. One, two, three, three. Yeah, 
Jesus Christ, blood, 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 all over the house, go in the yard, blood, 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 bathroom, kitchen, blood, 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 come on, Shia, drive out every spirit of heaviness, every insomnia, every sleepless spirit, drive them out, confusion, out, quarrel, arguments, out, out, Shia Basa. Peace in the house. Plead the blood. Plead the blood. Plead the blood. The blood of Jesus. Walk in the house now. Touch your children. Hallelujah. Touch the boy. Touch the girl. Hallelujah. Blood, blood, blood. Blood of blood Jesus. Cover Jesus. you. Cover you. In this blood festive season. Jesus. In this festive season. The blood of Jesus. Blood coverage. Cover your children. No car crash. I said, cover everybody in the house. No heart attack. No high blood pressure. No diabetes. Oh, yes, no septic yes, arthritis. Up your yes, mouth. God. No kidney failure. Yes, no God. liver failure. Yes, Up your mouth. Yes, no God. new moon. Yes, Up your mouth. Up your mouth. Up your mouth. Yes, God. Yes, God. Shire. Yes, God. Yes, God. Roar. Yes, God. Touch the place. Yes, God. Yes, God. Touch the yes, place God. where you feel yes, the fear. Yes, God. Yes, God. 
Rub. Rub the pain now. Rub the pain now. Rub it. Where you feel the pain? Rub the pain now. Rub it. And say, I'm healed. I'm healed. I'm healed. I'm healed. I'm healed. I'm healed. Shire. Touch it and drive it out of your man. Touch it in the name of Jesus and drive it out. I said, touch the place where you feel the pain. Touch it and drive it out. Be healed. In the name of Jesus Christ. Be healed. Be touched. Be, Be delivered. Now. Now. Lord of Jesus Christ, open your mouth. 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 Shout again. Shout again. Shout one more praise. Glory to God. Glory to God. Where is the worship? I say something now. Believe I say something now. Church, listen to me now. As of this morning, somebody say, fasting, consecration, start. Come on, somebody. As of this morning, Monday morning, consecration, start. Somebody say, this church is on consecration. Come on, sanctify yourself. Pray and fast. Somebody wave your hands and say, Lord, consecrate me. Set me apart for yourself. Make me holy. Use me, Lord. Please, Jesus, take my body. Take my soul. Take my spirit. I give my heart to you. Shia Basa. From Monday to Friday, we'll be fasting and consecration. Pray. Whatever weakness is in your life, bring it to the cross. Ask God for this strength to be a child of God that please him. Ask God to keep you in this crooked and evil world. Hallelujah. Seek the Lord and watch God work in your life. Friday will be Lord's Supper. Friday, everyone that need a touch from God, everyone that desire to eat of the Lord's body and drink of the Lord's blood, be out at Lord's Supper. The reason for Lord's Supper is to show the debt of our Lord Jesus Christ until he comes. And as often as you come to the table, you shall receive life. Whatever weakness you have, whatever sickness you have, though in this week you bring it to the Lord and ask the Lord to heal, to strengthen, to do it for you. When you go to the table, Whatever you seek, like Exodus chapter 12, God told Moses, each lamb for a house. When Israel leave Egypt, there was not one feeble. No one was weak. No one was sick. They left healthy. Why? Because they have the knowledge of the lamb. Anyone that have a foot problem in that house, they eat the foot. And by the time they were to step out, that foot was healed. If you have a belly problem, you're going for the belly. That's why God says, don't throw away the intention.